Hey everybody, I'm here at the 3D Fuse booth at Earth 2019. I'm with Cody. How you doing, Cody? Good, how are you? Oh, man, I'm great. There is so much cool stuff here. But I saw this and I had to get over here. Now, I believe you guys do like linear rail mods for all sorts of stuff. Is that right? The ender right over there, the uh, linear rails for X, Y, and Z. We do it for most Creality printers. Right now we're working on the uh, TiVo series printers and some other printers as well. That's great. So I have a couple under, I have three under fives and, and two under threes. I have a Tarantula Pro. Um, so, I, I mean, I've seen a video out there by a guy named Brian Vines. He did some really cool stuff for you. And uh, can you tell me a little bit about, you know, how they're made, what they do, that kind of thing? Yeah, so these are uh, water jet cut aluminum machines. Basically, we water jet cut the plate stock. And that way, when you bolt it together, everything is square. Uh, they have linear rails, uh, Duet 2 Wi-Fi or Duet 2 Ethernet. Um, we have the Titan Arrow on them, Meanwell Power Supplies, 24 volts, uh, 124, or 120 volt Canovo heaters, AC heaters on them. Uh, we try to pick all the best components, 300 millimeters a second, and it's probably peaking out at 300 on the back edge there, but as obviously through the curves, arcs, and acceleration, it's not hitting that. That's awesome. So, so we were talking about the kits you make, and you make them for Creality uh, printers, and you do all three access, right? Can you tell us a little bit about that? Yeah, so the idea was is when you bolt on a linear rail to an extrusion, if the extrusion's bent, the linear rail is going to suck down to that extrusion, causing issues. So we decided to do a bolt-on kit that was simple, easy, so you could just bolt it onto your printer and then have an easy way to get linear rails on your printer. Uh, we went with plate stock, so it bolts on smooth. It's got good flatness tolerance. And then that way there's easy transition, easy motion for the, for the printer for those axes. So what's the benefit of doing something like this? The benefit is faster motion without artifacting. And... Linear rails have a smoother motion, so there's less uh, maintenance that's needed. Uh, there's only you got only only thing you got to do with oil them. You don't have to adjust the wheels. You don't get flat spots in the wheels, and that is the biggest downfall to the Creality printers: uh, the adjustment, the continuous adjustments, and the wear that happens to the rubber wheels. So this is vase mode printed just under three hours. Yep. That is super cool. Yeah. Yeah, anything else cool you want to talk to us about? Uh, I don't have anything else. No, <laughs> it's all right here. Facebook, social media, Instagram, Twitter. All those. Well, thank you so much for your time. I appreciate it.